Essentially, when, you, when we talk about world war, it's fighting around the world, not just here. Oh, look, absolutely. Well, you look at, uh, I think the plan was this. Putin went into Ukraine, Ukraine was supposed to collapse, then Putin would have, nu- would, would have issued a nuclear blackmail notice to NATO, disband or we nuke you. At the same time, um, China would have attacked uh, Taiwan. Well, probably, I think they will even bypass Taiwan. They would have attacked Hawaii and the west coast of the United States. South North Korea would have attacked South Korea. Iran would have attacked the Middle East, Israel. And then we would have had massive influx across the southern border as well and terrorist, inst- terrorist attacks inside the United States. All together. America's not prepared to fight a one-front war, let alone a four- or five-front war. So, yeah, it would be... Well, we're, we're, the only thing I think stopping World War Three right now is the bravery and the courage of the Ukrainians. If it wasn't for Ukraine, we'd already be in World War Three. Now, that's an interesting take. Uh, it seems that the Ukrainians are, are losing. They're taking uh, devastating losses. No, no, they, they are... They are No, no. They are doing very, very well against the Russians. Extremely well. The Russians are losing four to four, something like four men to every one the Ukraine loses, but the Russians have a greater store of men. What has to happen is is we have to give them as much weaponry as quickly as we can so that Ukraine can decisively defeat Russia. That will lead to the toppling of Putin. That will probably lead to uh, rebellions in Iran, lead to rebellion, rebellions in China. And I think this is a decisive moment. If, we can, if the Ukrainians can win this, we could see a toppling of the, uh, the KGB regime in Russia. We could see the end of the CCP. The world could be a very, very different place. So um, we should be so grateful to Ukraine for what they're doing right now. But isn't sending our uh, artillery uh, to the Ukraine depleting America's own defenses? Well, yeah, it is. But, you know, you know if we lose Ukraine, we're going to be in World War Three, on multiple fronts. And so, yeah, there's no great options here. We, we are risking, we are depleting our own stuff, absolutely. But we've got, we've got to be in to win it. If we win this, we stop World War Three. If we lose it, we have World War Three. As I say, supplying Ukraine risks World War Three. Not supplying Ukraine guarantees World War Three. So we're going to be, we're going to be, uh, we're in. We're we're either going to help win this war, and that is going to come at a cost to America, or we're going to let it fold, and then we're in World War Three, fighting on every front, and we're in huge trouble.